Several prohibitions revealed their plans for Independence Day 2016 in this Shanice Beckles report. In anticipation of Guyana's 50th independence anniversary, this newscast interviewed persons in the New Amsterdam area to get their views on how they planned on spending their Independence Day. All of the persons interviewed were happy to share their plans for the day as it promises to be an exciting day for most of the senior citizens of Guyana. First, I'd like to say happy independence to the, His Excellency, the government and the people of Guyana over 50 year of anniversary. We have come a long way as a people and I hope and pray that God Almighty will continue to bless our country. On the day of the celebration we will have a church service in our church with our member and pray to God Almighty bless our nation. In 1966 I was a little boy but you know I could vividly remember I was going to Leeds Government School and those days we have a lot of pen and exercise books were shaking around and a lot of googies say, you know, to the children at that time in school, you know. And it was a good time, you know, everybody was having a ball at that time, you know. They, and to me, there were no division of people at that time, you know. So we have to... Yes, of course, of course, yes. But decency were there. You know, and there were good times. So you're yeah. with the that are planning this year for I think so. Fifty years, yes, of course. I'm happy. I'm very, very happy that our president see it fit, so that we all should be involved and have a good time as one people, one nation, one destiny. We had songs and poems, and we had the chapel celebrated the guy in Edge of Mesozola who wrote. The they um, change to a Guyana. Many youths also shared the same enthusiasm about the independent celebrations, although they were too shy to be interviewed. The few this newscast spoke to had major plans for how their day would be spent. Well, Thursday, well, I'll be in the barber shop, you know what I'm saying? Cutting some, making some money. Because Thursday, we got head on to tongue, you know what I'm saying? Jubilee celebration, 50th anniversary, you think? Turn up and burn up, you know what I'm saying? So just link at the barbershop, they get the haircuts, you know what I'm saying? Modern production, link up. On the 26th of May, my plans, well, I'll be celebrating my birthday as well as uh, Golden Jubilee anniversary. And uh, basically my plans are to invite some of my friends over. We'll be having lunch and then after that we'll maybe go for a walk somewhere and just chill and end the day and celebrate. That's it. Thank you. Happy Golden Jubilee. This year's independence celebration has put a buzz in the air and the togetherness among people of different culture and backgrounds. A true demonstration of our motto, one people, one nation, one destiny. Shinis Beckles reporting for our Channel 8 News.